FBI released shocking emails on a notorious Loretta Lynch Bill Clinton meeting that changed everything by Margaret Potts for USA Politics Today. This Friday, the FBI released a shocking document which contained 29 pages of DOJ emails about the meeting between former President Bill Clinton and Attorney General. At the time, Loretta Lynch, a few days before James Comey, said that the FBI will not press any charges against Hillary Clinton. From the Daily Wire, the email spanning from July 1st to the 3rd, 2016, contained correspondent, uh, correspondence among various DOJ officials to the leaking of the impromptu 30-minute meeting between Lynch and Clinton that the Attorney General insists were merely a personal chat about their grandchildren and recent travels, but what many continue to suspect had something to do with the ongoing investigation of then-presidential candidate Hillary Clinton. Comey's press conference, in which he announced that he would not request Lynch to pursue charges, was on July 5th. Even though these emails reveal nothing out of the ordinary, they do reveal the intention of some Justice Department officials to hide these meetings at all costs, which is an indicator uh, to something else. Katie Palvik for, from the Washington Free Beacon provided a summary of what these emails have. A series of emails show one FBI official whose name and email are redacted, fuming over leaks to the media about the meeting and what happened on the tarmac. The official received an email from a layman alleging a local Phoenix police officer who may have talked to a reporter sounds like a security threat. Officials went back and forth about finding out if the officer was SWAT or simply worked the motorcade and that at a minimum he should never work another detail again. One asked if local law enforcement assisting the FBI on motorcades should sign non-disclosure agreements in the future. Another official called an Observer article about the meeting with details about how President Clinton got to Lynch's private plane, infuriating, quote, these documents also contain correspondence from Peter Strzok, who was removed from the Russia investigation led by Mueller. Well, uh, I, I believe a lot was uh, sinister about that meeting. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below, and again, thank you so much for watching.